What's going on, fellas? How the hell are you? This is Islander. Welcome back to the island. All right, guys, it is Operation Day, all right? And I released a video early this morning, and that video was recorded the night before, okay? So we were on the eve of the operations. Of course, I brought you the little rumor. Uh, everything I expected to see in this operations did not come to pass, okay? Uh, I woke up early this morning, got ready, got taken off to work, got on the game, saw the operations, purchased the purchased the operations, all right, without even thinking twice, thinking it was going to be the same thing that we had before. Uh, in my head, I was like, it's going to be as good, maybe even better. I'm good to go. I have no concerns, okay? But we're going to come into the operations. We're going to take a quick look at it. We're going to do this, and then we're going to go back, and we're going to do a comparison, guys, from Raging Typhoon to Gathering Storm. So you can see the the huge difference, okay? So there's the, the first two prizes you get. You're going to start off with uh, 6 million in silver, uh, 200 gold at level 2. You're going to start seeing the prizes. I don't got to count each one out for you. We'll just go over certain ones, okay? Minimal amounts of gold, minimal amounts of keys. Uh, silver is okay, but it's not all that. Power cells, there they are. Okay, and then we start coming into some boosters. And these are the health boosters. We don't see that we get the, we should be getting the economy boosters, okay? Uh, man, all right, so there's uh, the legendary pilot. I mean, the legendary paint, and I believe that was going to be for the, uh, the Ares. I'm sorry, for, for the Hades, the Hades, guys. Forgive me there. Okay, and we start going up in value just a little bit at a time. And we get damage boosters. All of these boosters are, are what we get in our, in our daily uh, our daily tasks. So a lot of us have plenty of the damage and health boosters. Those are not really, really a plus. These here, these are okay. They're a little bit better as far as the boosters are concerned. And the key numbers start going up just a little bit at a time. Okay. Then we come to the first set of components, and they are uh, for the the small ember, the uh, igniter. Okay, and then there's your first uh, pulsar, all right, the unique pulsar. Uh, that was pretty cool. I like that. There is going to be two of them in this uh, event, guys, all right? So you'll be able to get two of them. You're going to be setting up on a... Uh, on any type of death button setup, okay? Uh, whether it's going to be the raven or, or the... Griffin, if you still run a Griffin, the Ares, anything that runs the death button setup. Okay, so here we go. We're just moving along, letting you see them, guys. Okay, and then there's uh, the boosters or the, the the battle boosters or whatever they're called. That gives you a little bit of a more OXP. And then we come back to more damage uh, boosters. And see, that is the legendary paint for... Blackbird, legendary pay. Okay, I thought we were getting a different one. Okay, pilots, shield boosters. I mean, uh, yeah, shield boosters, Corona components. There's the legendary pilot for the nemesis. Key boosters. And see, okay, Nemesis components, more Coronas, silver, and that's a legendary paint job for the, uh, for the Heishi, back to the igniter, power cells, more boosters, so it looks like you're going to be able to pull the Nemesis out of this event as well, all right, looks like it's gearing up towards that, we're at level 58, and there's a legendary paint job for the Mercury. And the legendary paint job for the... Is that the Nemesis? It looks like the Nemesis. Yeah, it's the Nemesis. So we've got a lot of legendary paint jobs in here for sure. Okay. Gold is a little bit down. Not a little bit down. Gold is a lot down. Silver is way down in this particular event. Keys, everything. But we're going to give you that breakdown in just a minute. All right. So we're just kind of going and talking along. There, the final we get to the economy boosters. I think the economy boosters should be all over this thing. All right, forget the health, forget the damage. Give us the ability to, to get more silver out of this.
key boosters. Okay, there's the legendary paint for, for the Falcon. All right, and there's the legendary paint for the Aljun. And they will be a uh, available at level 80. Now, the, the silver track, guys, the silver track is going to be available all the way up to level 80 instead of level 60 this time, all right? So it has been extended. But there's one thing that is just a little bit different, all right? A little bit different. We're going to go over that in just a minute. Something I'm really not happy about. I don't think a lot of you are happy about it either. But we're going to cover it all. And you can take a look at everything else. So we're getting all the way down to the very, very end. More damage boosters. More igniter boosters. Power cells. Gold. All right. All the way up to the uh, the unique uh, tier bot. And that's going to be the main prize at level 100. Okay, so we got an additional 20 levels. Uh, both the silver and the gold pass uh, got an extension as far as the uh, the amount of levels that they can achieve. Okay, so that was all well and good. We had talked a little bit about that. I thought it was going to be back at 80, but I was wrong. Final later on, it was going to be level 100. And this brought a lot of excitement. Okay, a lot of excitement that we have an additional 20 levels. That means we're going to get more prizes, you know, for the same amount of a purchase, that should have been a huge value, all right? But things change. Things don't stay the same. And we're gonna leave it right here in the black market so that we can jump over and then come right back to the black market. Now we're gonna do the comparison for you guys, all right? And this is where things are way off. And we're gonna go over this step by step, so bear with me, all right? Even though you can read it, you can screenshot it if you want, go over it later on. But this is what it is. Raging Typhoon. The amount of silver for the free pass. 22 million. Gathering Storm. I'm sorry. Gathering, it should be flipped around. So we're going to go for, from right to left now. So in Gathering Storm, we had 45 million. In Raging Typhoon, you have 22 million. And the, and the gold, and the gold uh, part. 125 to 79 million. Total, 170 million in Gathering Storm. And in Phase 2, the Raging Typhoon is not so raging, all right, with 101 million. They docked it 69 million silver. Okay, then we'll go over the gold. You can see here, Gathering Storm, 1750, 5100, and a total of 6850. On the opposite side, 420, 3040, and a total of 3000. 760 that's about a 40 percent cut power cells you can see the same over here okay i believe we're going to get more power cells in this one so you have uh 17 50 7, 000, and a total of 9200 power cells and the raging typhoon they gave us a lot more power cells okay so is this how they different differentiate differentiated uh the gold and the silver by giving additional power cells because we have 4,200, 1775, 17,750, and 21, almost 22,000 in power cells overall. So that is a huge bonus or increase from where they were at. Weapons, okay, last time two Pinatas, two, two Tolumbus, right? This time you have two Pulsars, which are the, the, the specialty weapons. So we didn't get a specialty bot, we got the specialty weapons. But there are no additional weapons that I can see here other than the uh, the... Igniter, maybe I'm missing something there, okay? Uh, pilots, we had one regular paid pay, okay? So we had a total, let's go with, just go with the totals. Three regulars and three legendary, okay? Uh, this time around, we're going to get two regulars and one legendary. Components, last time we picked up the Viper and the Inquisitor. This time, here it is, okay? The Igniter, the Corona, and the Nemesis. So we'll be able to pick up all three of those, and then, or you'll be able to get two Igniters, one Corona and the Nemesis bot, all right? Nemesis is the bot I still don't have yet, but when I acquire it, it's not going to be really a target item for me to upgrade with everything else that's going on in the game, with the Phantoms, with the Leeches. Uh, you know, I still have my speed bots that I like to run, so the Nemesis will not make his way into the lineup, even with the buff that it got. I don't believe it's going to have the power that it needs to compete, all right? We're still going to be able to get inside that shield. And we're still going to be able to do the damage that we need to do with a lot less firepower coming at you uh, than you had with the Ares. All right. So the Pursuer will have a field day 
with the nemesis. That's my early assessment of this, okay? So let's see what we got. Uh, Gathering Storm, we had uh, three skins. Okay, over here we have a total of seven legendary skins. So they increased the legendary skins. And the Ancient Bot, I mean, the, the bot that we're going to win, which is the, the, the grand prize, is uh, the Ancient Tier. Last time around, we had the Griffin, all right, and the Aljun. So we had two bots last time. Uh, this time, they're giving you a bot and a legendary weapon. All right. Gathering Storm was way better, by far. Not even a photo finish. Nowhere close, all right? Gathering Storm was much better in the event than Raging Typhoon. Now, in my honest opinion, you know, the overall value, so silver, gold, uh, keys, minus the power cells, okay? The bigger value was in Gallery Storm. And I really expected the same kind of thing to carry over, if not better. Now, we got an additional 20 levels to complete for less value. 20 more levels, less prizes. Excluding the power cells. It's not a good deal. I mean, hell, if I could get if I could get a refund on my fifteen dollars, I, I would take my fifteen dollars back. I wouldn't want this this pass, right? I would just take the free track and whatever I get, I get. Oh, well and good. You know, I wasn't really in it for the bot. The bot was not the the prize, nor the pulsar do it because I don't run either the bot or pulsar weapons. So this is of no benefit to me. What the real benefit was the amount of silver, the amount of gold, the amount of keys. Uh, the power cells and everything else that you got in total, all right, versus uh, what we got now. It's not a good deal. I don't have an clue as to who did the numbers over there or how they figured this out. You know, maybe, and just bear with me, guys, maybe they're trying to get a middle ground here, okay? Somewhere between Raging Typhoon and Gathering Storm. They may find the middle ground of what they're looking for. The first one, they gave away a lot. This one, they gave away what I would call very little compared to the first one. Okay? Maybe they're looking for middle ground. Or maybe, just maybe, they got something planned for us that they haven't released to us or that they haven't told us about for the Halloween event. Okay? Maybe the Halloween event is going to come in and, and give us uh, something to, to offset uh, the Raging Typhoon compared to the Gathering Storm. That is just a maybe, guys. That is just a wild guess. That is not a rumor. All right. I, that is not hearsay. I didn't hear that from anybody else. You know, uh, I'm just kind of guessing here that maybe this is possible. Because you would think that you would get something like the Gathering Storm and the Raging Typhoon and plus whatever they want to give you in the Halloween event. You know, make something good uh, for the players considering everything that's going on in the uh, mobile market right now. There's a lot of new stuff that's up and coming. You would think they would want to make things a lot more enticing to the player base that they have. Okay? So, this is my take on all of this, guys. I want your feedback, your comments in the comment section below. And once again, boys and girls, you will keep it non-toxic. Get your statement across. Say what you got to say. But you say it in a proper way. Don't come over here with all that Facebook toxicity stuff, all right? Not going to... Not going to put up with it. Don't need to hear it. This is not that kind of channel. You want to be toxic? Take your ass over to Facebook and you can be as toxic as you want all day long, every day. Okay? Here we have discussions. Real discussions about the game that we all love to play, that we enjoy, that we share together. Okay? So, on that note, let's go ahead and get out of here. Y'all make sure you take your screenshots of that so you can go and, and do what you need to do with them. Now let's jump over and let's get into a game real quick. Let's get out of... Uh Okay, we're not going to do uh, free-for-all. What are we going to do? What are we going to do? What are we going to do? All right, let's see. we got a skirmish. Uh, we got a domination, beacon rush, team death match. You know what? We'll just leave it up to the Pixonic gods. How about that? Okay, let's get a little few boosters rolling. Pat, 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 pat. And we're going to jump over. Hey, where, where's the where's the quick draw? <laughs> oh, there it is. Quick match. All right. We're going to let the Pixonic Gods decide what we're going to do. We know for sure it will not be a free-for-all, okay? It's going to be one of the other three. Whatever it is, it is. Let's go have a little fun. 
looking really looking forward to your comments a lot of you have already started commenting on this morning's video uh maybe i should have held off on it and wait to release this video but i do want to get that early rumor out to you guys and it is a beacon rush Okay, everybody took over without me. I'm 27 seconds late to the party. Got something for you. <laughs> oh, that Loki didn't have a clue what was about to hit him. Whoa. Okay, let's get over here. We got three on the left side. I got a three on one situation, so that's not good. Let's take a couple of pop shots. There they go. Let them come. Let them come. Let them come. Let them come. Gonna bait them in as much as possible. And I got three Arjuns that I'm dealing with. Let's see if we can get it before it drop. Man, that ran out quick. Okay, I need to get my, my shield back before we do this. There it is. We'll drop it where he stands. Uh-oh. Now I got two areas to deal with. Man, yo, where the hell is my team? I need a little team action over here, baby. Okay, we're going to triple team this guy now. Good job, blue team. Coming in for the save. Okay, they got one speed bot. And did he make a bad move? And I waited too long. Full blunder that one. Alright, let's see if we can finish him off. Come on, baby. Come on. Come get some. Man. All right, let's stay. We're going to stay right there where we're at. Got a little bit of lag rolling on me. And at this rate, yeah, they are going to bot out. They have lost a whole lot of bots. See if we can force them to put that shield up. Shoot me. That's right. Gotta get in, get it, get it, get in. There you go. Where's that the shield? And it's, let's see if the team keeps firing on me. No, they're not. All right. Where's he at? Where's he at? There they are. Let's 
fall back. Three seconds, two seconds, one second, we're in. The Flaming Leo. Good job, blue team. All right, get over there to the tape, uh, see how we did, and we'll get ready to put it into this video. All right, pull a 2.3, eight kills, three beacons. Had a lot of fun over there on the left hand side, all right. Uh, it seemed like it was constantly on a Two on one, three on one, four on one there for a little while to start with. Uh, we got a good little roll going with that uh, early Aries, all right? I see that uh, roll coming to a very, very quick end uh, once they, they do their update. But all in all, really, really good uh, matchup, all right? Let's get out of here. So once again, guys, let me know what y'all think about the operations. I, for one, am not happy with it all. I think they blundered this one pretty good, all right? Uh, I think they should have done something very similar or even better than what they had in the last uh, update, all right? If they were going to make some modifications, they need to be small modifications, not the drastic ones that were made. Uh, Gathering Storm should have been the Raging Typhoon, all right? And this one is the Gathering Storm. They should have flipped them, made the first one semi-okay, and then hit us with, with, with a home run in the second one. I think that would have been a lot better. But in the comment section, I want your feedback. Guys, if you're new to this channel, hit that sub button. Also, hit that bell for notifications so you don't miss any of the stuff we're going to have coming up. And if you did like this video, guys, knock the hell out of the like. I really do appreciate it, and it does help me out. And until we talk again, boys and girls, this is Islander signing out.